Hello everyone, this is Blood Queen Tara. <laughs> and I am here to do a reading for the karmic. This is the karmic's weekly reading for this week. So, the karmic could be a male or a female. The karmic may or may not be your karmic. So, um, keep in mind that the reading, it may or may not resonate with you. Some parts of the reading might resonate, other parts of the reading might not. As well, keep in mind that time is fluid, so this reading can manifest, um... This week, it could manifest later on down the line of time. Um, or this present reading could be past energy for you. If this present reading is past energy for you, then there might be answers or closure for you in this present reading that pertains to your past situation or circumstance. So I didn't really get um messages for the karmic during a pre-shuffle. So I'm going to show you guys what's at the bottom of the decks. So we have Twin Flame. This is a divine counterpart connection. So collective, I'm picking up the karmic could be the third party in your connection if you're not the karmic between you and your twin. So it's like spirit want the karmic to know that you and your lover or you and your twin is a divine counterpart connection. I heard see your way out. So something like that going on with the karmic. We got astral travel. You may be having out of body experiences. So, collective, the karmic could be having an out-of-body experience, or collective, the karmic wants you to have an out-of-body experience. The karmic could be jealous of you guys concerning love and romance, because they're the third party, or they're the karmic in your twin flame connection. The karmic could be a Scorpio, or collective, you a Scorpio, or the karmic could have Scorpionic placement, Scorpio placement, because we got truth at the bottom of the deck in the tower. And then judgment... So the karmic could definitely be a Scorpio or collective. If you're not the karmic, you could definitely be a Scorpio. And then we got spying, keeping tabs. So the karmic could be spying on somebody, keeping tabs on somebody. The karmic being fake. Collective, for some of y'all, the karmic is your ex. They're pretending they changed. They're being fake. So collective, um, whether you're in union with your twin or not, the karmic could be your ex or your twin's ex, and the karmic might uh, try to reconcile with you or your lover. The karmic is pretending that they change, but they're being fake. So, collective, this could be your karmic or your twin's karmic or your ex or your twin's ex, if you're not the karmic. And then we got toxic ways. Collective, the karmic could also be doing, could, could have some type of addiction or the karmic self-medicates. Collective, if you're not the karmic, I'm picking up the karmic don't like when people talk good shit about you. It's like this trigger the karmic's toxic ways when people talk good shit about you. Collective, for some of y'all, I heard the karmic might try to reconcile with your lover because people was talking good shit about you. So, the karmic, yeah. So, collective, I don't know if y'all all work together. Is you, your twin, and the karmic? Y'all can all work together. And people could be talking good shit about you at work. So, the karmic might try to slide off and holler at your lover or your twin. Something like that going on with the karmic. The karmic could definitely be a Scorpio. All right. What's the karmic's overall energy or overall message for this week? For the karmic? Universe. <clears throat> so the karmic could be getting some type of success. This is equivalent to the world. The karmic could be a Capricorn or an Aquarius. Don't have to be. The karmic could be traveling. The karmic might get some type of success. All right. What's the karmic? What's going on with the karmic concerning love and romance this week? 
So interference. And external party is, is intruding on this relationship. Collective, your twin could be, um, collective for some of y'all, your twin could be dating the karmic or interacting with the karmic. And, um, if you're not the karmic, you might interfere or something. Or collective, your twin could be dating the karmic, interacting with the karmic. And your twin might get in touch with you and you're going to collaborate with your twin. So, collective, you might get in touch with your twin or your twin might get in touch with you. With you. For some of y'all, it's been a while. So, it's like, collective, if your twin, if you haven't saw your twin in a while, your twin get in contact with you and ask you out on a date, you're going to go. So, you're the interference. Like, something like that. Or, collective, for some of y'all, you might meet your twin for the first time this week. And I don't know whether you're aware of it or not, but it's like your twin could be dating a karmic or connected to the karmic. And you, you're like the third party. Or collective, you could be a Scorpio. And you might try to holler at the karmic's lover, but the karmic's lover is your twin. So it's like you're the interference or something like that. All right, what's going on with this karmic? Wrong deck. What's going on with this karmic? Pulling back on that ass. 